Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you my books inside my survival kit so far. Uh, my first book is on survival and my other book is on the United States Marine Guidebook. Um, I, I mean, I'm going to use books because maybe when the world ends there's not going to be internet. But the internet was developed by the military and it's supposed to survive a uh, nuclear war. Um, anyways. Whatever happens, it happens. Um, I'm going to start with my United States Marine guidebook. I'm going to show you some few tips or pictures just to show you like how to survive. Um, here, here we have some uh, how to tend some wounds, broken arm, legs. It's all about improvising. Improvise. Um, Pick one of those to move your friends or whatever out of a danger zone into a, a, a safe area. Start to carry your buddy. There's different ways how to carry him if you can stand up. This is how you start. Go up the list, and this is how you should end up. Um, here's more ways. This is more difficult. This one, yeah, it's the same one. Difficult. How to use this one last week? One of my friends got injured in a soccer game and uh, had to carry him out out of the field like that because there was no medical staff around. So yeah, pretty important. Oh, how do I use a river? <laughs> Drinking and cooking, bathing, water, I mean washing clothes and being in washing vehicles. It's how to purify your water inside a canteen. What to do with human waste. Um, you should bury it because it might start bacteria and diseases. You don't want that. And these are some of the signs you might see out there. Gas, bio, auto. And gas mines. I don't know what that is. Uh, what to do while an explosion erupts and you're outside? Wait 90 seconds in your bunker until all debris falls. Tanks are an excellent protection. <laughs> and here are some more examples. Oh, and if you if you come across some grenades, here's the way uh, the proper way to throw them. Start an A, B, C, and then work yourself down the list. When you stand up, this one on your knees down here. Um, if you're laying down on the ground, and that's about it for this one. There's a lot, of, a lot, lot more stuff. Fitness here. Here's the table of contents. Oh my God. So all the contents. Here, I'm gonna show you my other book. This book is um survival. Seventy. I don't know what that means. It's not in the back. Yeah, I'm sure some few pictures like the other one. Here's how to. Oh, it's gonna be hard. How to signal and play. Here are all the different signals. I don't know if you guys can read it, but one, each sign means something. Here, let me look at my other one. How to find water. Keep your water. How to use your bait. Fishing. Make different hooks. Make some traps to capture those little animals or big animals. Uh, I've seen traps like they can catch um like up to like fox or like big lion mount lions. That's a lot of food when you're surviving. Oops. How to start fire? There's some few method methods. Fucking speak. <laughs> uh, how to spark? 
make fire like that. Uh, use your binoculars, as your lens binoculars to make fire. I actually do have binoculars in my survival kit, so that's good. And the other one is how to like skin and like do all the stuff to animals and eat them. Poor animals. Hey, let's try to make a cup or a container. Here are more fish baits. Here, let me see if we can find some more stuff for you guys. Well, there's a lot of stuff in this book. This book is great. It's a lot, a lot of stuff in there. It's a lot of information on these two little books. And they don't weigh a lot. Um, so yeah, this is it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And sorry for my language. <laughs> I have trouble speaking. <laughs> and see ya. I'll be making more videos. I promise. Bye. Oh, here, wait. Yeah, bye.